Nigeria on Wednesday recorded 587 new cases of COVID-19, pushing the nation's total infections towards the 18,000 mark. The Nigeria Center for Disease Control in a tweet stated that the country has now confirmed at least 17,735 cases of the novel coronavirus with 469 deaths and 5,967 recovered patients. Nigeria is currently in the second phase of easing its lockdown restrictions, with worship centers expected to restart in certain states. Meanwhile, the President, Muhammad Buhari, on Wednesday said the socioeconomic disruptions that had so far characterized the COVID-19 pandemic has proved too hard for many countries to cope with. Buhari said the health systems of many nations had also been severely tested by the pandemic. The President said this in a statement he presented at the virtual extraordinary China-Africa Summit on Solidarity Against COVID-19, co-hosted by the Forum for China-Africa Cooperation. He said, and I quote, the COVID-19 outbreak is a clear wake-up call for all of humanity. Humanity. Buhari told the summit co-hosted by the Chinese President Xi Jinping, South African President and African Union Chairperson Cyril Ramaphosa and Senegalese President and Co-Chair of FOCAC, Marcus Hall, that there was need uh, for unity in tackling the pandemic. He also noted that the world was at a critical crossroad, saying countries had been hit hard by the tragedy of the pandemic. In a bid to contain the spread of the disease, he said countries had had to mobilize energy and resources to equip healthcare providers for adequate response to the challenges of the virus.